destination declutterers. So this is a, um, a bit of a twofer because this is going to be a little bit about travel, big surprise, big surprise, but also how packing for your travel is kind of like making a mini home for yourself for the time you're away, okay? So the first part of what I wanna share with you today because I find it so freaking handy is the concept of packing cubes. Now this goes out, this is a long distance dedication to some other pals of mine who are also traveling internationally while I too am packing to go international. And they didn't know about packing cubes. So let me give you a really short um, tutorial about those. Uh, there are plenty of other videos in the planet that'll show you how to use them and whatever. And I don't feel like packing in front of you. But basically what packing cubes are, are like these little bags right, that you put your stuff in when you are packing, okay? So what I do is I have like one for my unmentionables, I have one for my socks, I have one for my tops, and then I have one that's kind of like for my, my like pants or capris, and I usually put my pajamas in that one too, right? So what you do with these and this is, this is for my, my fellow um, international travelers, is you take them and you unzip them and then you fold up your clothes in them, right? You, I tend to roll them, rolling is supposed to be better, um, but then you put them in the bag and then the neat thing is, is you zip it up, right? Like, I'm not gonna do a whole thing, but you're gonna zip it up, you put your clothes in there and then you, um, zip it more and it shrinks up. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put pause and then I'm gonna roll up some so you see what I'm doing, okay? Hold on. Okay, okay, so I don't know, I'm gonna show you. So I just rolled up a bunch of my t-shirts, right? Um, as you can see, this is what I was cracking myself up with when I was doing it. Oh, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna zip it. See, I'm already kind of zipping it shut, right? Um, I was realizing that I pack a lot of um, black t-shirts because, well, that's how I roll get it? Okay, so there we go. You can hear the zip. So I just zipped them into this thing right here, right? But then the cool thing is it's got this secondary zipper that you do, and I often mess it up, but you do the secondary zipper, and if I don't catch the bag in it, oh, it's looking good, looking good. Oh, oh, there we go. Secondary zipper, all of a sudden, all these t-shirts take up much less space, and they can like fit in my suitcase, right? And then I put these, I get these little skinny ones here and I do the same with that, okay? So that's what packing cubes are. Now the reason I'm sharing that um, in a kind of declutter your house type of thing, which is kind of funny because obviously I'm in another room of my house really as an aside. I'm a clutter coach, but I say surround yourself with what you love, hence I don't have a single minimalist, you know, droopy flower on a white background home. I have stuff hanging in my house that I love. So see, you too can live surrounded by the stuff you love. But anyway, where was I? So how are packing cubes and getting ready for travel like decluttering your house? So here's how it is. That when you pack, you organize your items so they're easy to find right? I got my t-shirts here. I'll have my unders in this thing, right? So you take the items you want to have, you separate them out into categories, and then you find a home for them, right? Now, I believe in traveling light travel-wise. That's why I'm only bringing like this tiny suitcase for this like 10-day overseas trip and a, and a bag, but like I'm not bringing a giganto suitcase. Traveling light travel-wise and life-wise is so great because you can just kind of move in and out of the of everything in the in the airport you're not you know one of those people with like a steamer trunk and you're trying to move all the stuff when you get off of the plane you've got your stuff you're not trying to fit a giganto suitcase you're not bringing too much for fear you don't have enough what i say is you have enough it's organized that when you are packing, 
that you only bring what you need and you can reuse items. And nobody's going to judge you if you don't have the right thing. I have a black dress. I wear pretty much black all the time. Not because I feel black on the inside, my little Gen X Smith's friends, but it is true. Um, but I wear things over and over again because I'm not worried about it. It's not a fashion show. It's more important for me to only have what I need and have it organized and I can easily find it. That's the other thing. Much like when you're home, when you've taken all your stuff and you've sorted it out and everything has its home, then when you go to look for it, you know exactly where to go for it. You're not digging around. You're not digging around all your clothes looking for something. You know that your t-shirts are in your t-shirt drawer or your pajamas in your pajama drawer, things like that. So think of, just think of traveling light. Think of how, you know, you can only surround yourself with certain items and if you wanted to bring them with you that you know you don't need a ton of stuff you also might want some room to maybe bring home a, a you know a tchotchke or two but if you don't that's totally okay because then you don't have to dust it when you get home okay um so i share this with you because i am going off on another adventure um but how the reason i shared the packing with you is because i have learned that it is so freeing and so it feels so much lighter when you have just the stuff you need and you don't take anything else with you. Um, you move quicker, you feel better. You feel kind of cool because you've got your clued in. Ever see those really savvy travelers in the airport where you're like, you know they do this a lot because they are the ones that are just like zipping through, cool as a cucumber, as opposed to somebody frantically trying to bring everything with them in case they need it. And then all they're doing is lugging it around with them. You know, you can't fit a steamer trunk on a camel, people. So that's what I have for you and for my fellow, um, my fellow international travelers. So yes, try the packing cubes. I love them. They have been a game changer for me. Um, and I don't know, I think next week I'll have a different background that isn't my home, uh, because I'll be on traveling. All right. I will see you soon.